Is it the right time to make a decision about Rivian Automotive stock? In this video, we'll be delving deep into Rivian Automotive. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, January 17, 2024. Today, we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. We want to make sure you don't miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Take your trading decisions to the next level with our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any one of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please keep in mind that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. As of January 4, 2024, our system has identified Rivian Automotive as a sell candidate, with a score of minus 2.95. Now, let's dive into the stock's performance during this period. The stock has experienced a loss of 14.05%. This means that on average, it has been losing 1.56% per day since it was listed as a sell candidate. According to the current three-month trend, there is a potential 26.06% change expected over the next three months. This suggests a possible return ranging from 26.06% to 95.05%. Looking at the 12-month trend, it suggests a 21.2% change over the next year. This could result in a potential return between 14.66% and 117.71%. In terms of price, this translates to a range of $19.22 to $36.49 after one year. Our latest update on Rivian Automotive reveals that the stock price experienced a decline of 5.95% on Wednesday. On the last trading day, which was Wednesday, January 17, 2024, the stock price of Rivian Automotive fell from $17.82 to $16.76, marking a decrease of 5.95%. This decline has continued for six consecutive days. Throughout the day, the stock price fluctuated between a low of $16.28 and a high of $17.16, showing a 5.41% variation. Over the past 10 days, the stock price has fallen in 9 instances, resulting in a total decline of 20.57%. Although the trading volume increased by 24 million shares on the last day, the prices were still falling. This may indicate a potential risk in the coming days. The total number of shares bought and sold during this period was approximately 44 million, equivalent to a value of $745.33 million. Looking at the stock's performance over the past 52 weeks, the highest price recorded was $28.05, while the lowest price was $11.68. At present, the stock price is 40.25% or $11.29 below its 52-week high. Furthermore, it is 90.66% or $162.71 below its all-time high, which was achieved on November 16, 2021, with a price of $179.47. Analyst Ratings On Thursday, January 4, 2024, Wells Fargo gave RIVN a buy grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, November 8, 2023, RBC Capital gave RIVN a sector perform grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, November 8, 2023, Cantor Fitzgerald gave RIVN an overweight grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, November 8, 2023, Mizuho Securities gave RIVN a buy grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, November 8, 2023, Needham gave RIVN a buy grade with a hold action. Analysts have given Rivian Automotive stock a general rating of buy. They rate the P.E. ratio as a strong buy and the price to book as also a strong buy. In terms of return on investment, the analysts give the stock a rating of neutral. Today, we'll be discussing the current signals for Rivian Automotive. Unfortunately, there are few positive signals to report. Both short and long-term moving averages indicate sell signals, painting a negative forecast for the Rivian automotive stock. 
Additionally, the relation between these two signals suggests a general sell signal, as the long-term average remains above the short-term average. If the stock experiences any upward corrections, it will likely face resistance at the levels of $18.48 and $20.05. And However, if the stock breaks above these levels, it may issue by signals. On Tuesday, December 19, 2023, a sell signal was issued from a pivot top point, resulting in a considerable decrease of minus 31.17% so far. It is expected to continue falling until a new bottom pivot is found. Furthermore, the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD, also indicates a sell signal currently. Yesterday, volume rose on falling prices, which could be an early warning sign that the stock should be closely monitored. Today, we'll explore some interesting signals you should pay attention to. Let's start with the moving average convergence divergence. It's indicating a sell signal. Another important signal is the pivots, which showed a sell signal 19 days ago. On the other hand, the Bollinger signal indicated a buy 27 days ago. The short-term moving average is currently showing a sell signal from 14 days ago. Similarly, the long-term moving average is indicating a sell signal from 10 days ago. When we analyze the relationship between the short and long moving averages, it gave a buy signal 6 days ago. Now, let's take a look at the 12-month chart. The short moving average is signaling a sell from 12 days ago. Similarly, the long-term moving average is indicating a sell signal from 10 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages gave a buy signal 15 days ago. If you're interested in discovering more signals, be sure to visit our page at stockinvest.us. Today, let's talk about support, risk, and stop loss for Rivian Automotive. When it comes to support levels, we can see that the stock has found support just below its current level. This support comes from accumulated volume at $15.72 and $15.40. It's important to note that when a stock is testing a support level, there is a natural risk involved. If the support level is broken, the stock may then fall to the next support level. In the case of Rivian Automotive, the next support level would be at $15.72, followed by $15.40 and $15.33. Moving on to risk, it's worth mentioning that this stock is considered to be high risk due to its volatility. The stock may experience significant movement during the day, as indicated by the large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band. To put it into perspective, in the last day, the stock moved $0.88 cents between its high and low, which is equivalent to 5.41%. Over the past week, the stock has shown a daily average volatility of 4.86%. Before we discuss the potential trading levels for Rivian Automotive, let's begin by understanding some important fundamental data. Firstly, let's talk about the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This ratio compares a company's current share price to its per-share earnings. A negative P.E. ratio indicates that the company is making losses or has negative earnings. It is common for established companies to face downturns due to external factors. However, consistent negative P.E. ratios may indicate insufficient profits and potential risks of bankruptcy. Moving on, the upcoming earnings report for Q4 2023 is scheduled for February 27, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates for the earnings are at minus $1.37. It's important to keep an eye on these figures as they can significantly impact the stock prices. Today, we'll be discussing potential day trading levels for Rivian Automotive. If the stock shows an upward trend, the first resistance level for Rivian Automotive is at $17. If you're not currently holding any shares, it may be wise to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. However, if you're already holding the stock, this could be a level worth considering for swing trading. On the other hand, if the stock experiences a downturn, Rivian Automotive encounters its first support level at $15.72. If this support level holds, it could present a good entry point, with the anticipation of a rebound in the future. Rivian Automotive has received an average by rating from multiple analyst sources. Now let's explore some recent insider trades. On November 15, 2023, McDonough Clare sold 1,727 shares of Class A common stock. 
On November 16, 2023, McDonough Clare sold 3,265 shares of Class A common stock. On November 15, 2023, Baker Jeff sold 3,898 shares of Class A common stock. On October 20, 2023, Schwartz Sanford Herald bought 842 shares of Class A common stock. On October 20, 2023, Boone Karen bought 1,196 shares of Class A common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, the insider power ratio is minus 51.508, indicating a negative trend. In the last 100 trades, insiders purchased 2,467,775 shares and sold 31,848,770 shares. We have a negative evaluation for this stock and unfortunately, no stop loss has been set. Is Rivian Automotive stock a good buy? The Rivian Automotive stock currently shows negative signals. Despite a positive trend, our analysis suggests that Rivian Automotive may perform weakly in the near future. Therefore, we have a negative evaluation of this stock. Upon analyzing the volatility and movements of the last trading day, our systems indicate that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Thursday, January 18th, we anticipate Rivian Automotive to open down by $0.0267 and begin trading at $16.73. Before we begin, it's important to note that trading comes with a high risk of losing money. It's always a good idea to consult with a financial advisor before making any decisions to buy or sell securities. At StockInvest.us, we provide information, but it's crucial that you take responsibility for your own investment choices. This is our current view of the stock. We would love to hear your thoughts on whether you agree or disagree. Please leave a comment below and share your insights. What is your target for the stock? We value your engagement and appreciate your support by liking and subscribing to our channel. Our team at Stock Invest wishes you successful trading and hopes you have a wonderful day. Thank you for being a part of our community.